supporting four London people in London life. And this is an update. Uh, and before I go on any further, uh, to the child services uh, and maintenance, yeah, listen to me. Thank you very much, yeah. I'm all up to date, all paid for, yeah. My children are all good, yeah. So I want to talk about this in detail because it matters. So I was really, really, really upset the other day because it, it was just too much. It was all, all a bit too bad. But what I realised is, yeah, when the lady was speaking to me about fathers, yeah, and the way we're treated in England, she explained there's a reason for it, yeah. And then she said to me, yeah, and I thought this was really lovely, that some mothers, yeah, some kids' mums, baby mums, uh, children's mums, whatever you're going to call them, are actually yeah, so bad, there's going to be something put into place so baby dads or fathers yeah, of London or the world get a better deal. Because what you realise is, yeah, you're paying for children, yeah, and if you're anything like me, you're just paying for something and you're not being able to enjoy or see your children on a daily basis. And where you're lucky, if you're living with your children, that's a whole different stealth. Yeah, if you've been able to keep that relationship with your partner, but when that breaks down, yeah, then your be partner becomes very ignorant and becomes very tacky uh, with boyfriends uh, talking about you and stuff like that. And I like all of that, yeah, because you know he's there now and my child's there or someone's around, and this could be in any one scenario. And listen to what I'm saying is, so a girlfriend stops loving you, you move out the house, yeah, and you still want to do the decent thing to look after your children, to look after your children and every chance that you get, yeah. The lady said, yeah, if people do that to fathers, yeah, and I said they do that because I've experienced that myself, she said, there's something going to be put in place, yeah, where dads that want to be dads, yeah, can actually be dads without being financially crippled, yeah, into nothing. So my biggest response to that lady was, was thank you for that information. I'm not going to tell you at all, yeah, but kids' mums, now you're getting money, yeah, for your children, yeah, and whatever happens, yeah, the child deserves to have clothes on their back, yeah, Food in their stomachs, yeah, and schooling, yeah. It all comes as a package, yeah. So you can't just be living off the state and then when the state have give you the money from the fathers and also the money, yeah, that you get from the state, yeah, to look after the children, you've done something completely different with that money and now your child is looking very shabby. That's not fair. So this is reporting for fathers that want to be fathers, yeah? Real mums out there, I'm bigging you up always. I'm bigging you up every single time. Like my sisters, I big them up all the time, yeah? Always, 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 yeah? There's good mums out there, yeah? And out of 10, I can say that at least six or seven real good mums that look after their children and don't give uh, the dad's no back chat, yeah, or no trouble seeing the, the children. And that helps because like I'm saying to anybody else in the world, especially across the world where dads are finding it really hard, it takes two, yeah, people to lift up a child, yeah, man and a woman, yeah. If you can do that and get along, you don't have to be in the house with these people, yeah. But if you can get that relationship going, it means so much, yeah? Because that is the difference with a child's remembering who their dad is and not going to school, scorned, yeah? People taking the mic out. I always want to be in my kid's life. So to the agency that I spoke yesterday, thank you very much. It was a really brilliant conversation I had with you, yeah? And you supported, yeah, the fact that, you know, not everyone's like that. You're right, not everyone's like that. More coming up.